All right, grasshoppers, I'm gonna give you three things to think about when you're hitting low kicks on the heavy bag, a partner, or if you're just sparring in general, okay? First thing is, I see a lot of people telegraph their low kick by staring at the leg. They'll be sparring, moving, they'll stare at the leg, and then they'll kick it. So let's not lift low. I like us looking low when we attack high, but that's not what we're doing right now, so we're only gonna lift low if again we're attacking higher. For now, we're gonna kick low kicks, so let's look up top, not photograph our shot, okay? So keep your eyes up top, either eye to eye or look at their chest. Either way, I'd like to make sure you're not looking low telegraphing your shot. Because also, if I'm looking low and they're going to punch me, I'm not going to see that as well as if I was actually paying attention and looking at them, okay? So, rule number one, watch up top. Rule number two, hand placement. I like to have my lead hand on my face, rear hand out on their face or over their shoulder. Either way, I like to have it up. Cool. Give them something to think about. They might think it's a cross. They might try to slip outside. If they slip outside, boom, the weight will be on the lead leg. You can hit that low kick with more force, okay? So put the hands in their face. You can drop this hand, and I've done that many times. It will allow the hip to rotate a little bit more. But look, hands are down. I don't prefer that. I prefer to have my hands on their face. You know, I've done that a million times, okay? So number one, look up top. Number two, hand placement. Nice and tight and clean, okay? Third thing to think about is lead foot. Let's get the lead foot outside off the center line so that you're not right in front of them. Follow the foot, pivot on it. So I guess that's four things, but from the top, look up top, hand place on the bag, and hit that little kick. Allow the hip to come through, but make sure the lead foot is off the center line, not right in front of them. I mean, you can be in front of them and lean back and you got a range of the punch, but I prefer to have the body weight into the kick and be outside. Then the body will drop into it, okay? So for the top, three things. Look up top, touch the bag, leave foot outside. Cool. I'm getting the power off of my rear foot. I can give you a million things to think about right now, which is probably I would give you five or six. Let me recap the top three. Top three. Look here, don't tell the after shot, touch the bag, foot outside. Cool. Off the center line. Whoops.